Hi, I'm Diane. I own Red Poppy Wig Salon and I'm located in the Kansas City metro area. I've been working with wigs now for 13 years. I've been a cosmetologist over 40 years. I've worked with thousands of women walking through either a cancer diagnosis or some other health problems that have caused them hair loss. So this is a passion of mine and I'm so glad you helped that you joined me today and I'd be happy to help you in any way that I can. Today I want to introduce the second of three Raquel Welch wigs for spring 2020, 2022. Okay, um, yes, 2022 spring Raquel Welch wigs. The so brand new out of the box. Um, the first one we will do is the 5161, which is Ice Granita which is one of the favorite new grays that they that Raquel came out with a few years ago. Uh, this wig is a made of the heat defiant synthetic. It has temple to temple lace with a hand tied part. And the back is machine wefted but it's got a silicone on it that helps keep it from sliding, which I really like. So this one's a shorter style, and with the Ice Granita, if you're not familiar, it's white in the front, but it, it graduates to dark at the base, which is really typical of how people gray. Not everyone, of course, but a lot of people. So let's see how this one and shorter, sometimes with shorter wigs, because I have a larger head, they don't fit as well. And of course I can't camouflage the space that isn't covered as well. So we'll see. Okay, that cap's not, not terrible. It's not, it's, it's probably just a good average. It fits, it fits my head. Um, so that's, that's good news. So let's take a look. We've got quite a bit of length in the front. And then the, put, I'll take that pick, stick the tag in. There we go. And then we've got the fullness. One thing that I really enjoy about the heat friendly fiber is that you can get more volume just by running your fingers through it. It's um, and doing something like that. The other synthetics don't do that quite as well, the traditional synthetic, but um, this is a cute wig. I think it's going to be a good, a good option for a lot of people and it's you could actually put a bang in it too so if that was what you wanted instead of but easily off your face you know it's made to do that is a the side so it's it feels like it's a little asymmetrical so there's more hair on the right side than on the left, as far as length. It was, and there you can see where my hair is. So I would pull some of the wig down just to camouflage that. On that side, it doesn't matter. And I tend to, because of the face shape of my face, I tend to like to have some fullness here to bring that that volume brings into the focus on my eyes um, but that's it's very cute again this one is called go to style in the ice granita So next, I'm going to show you the same wig. 
in the, if I can get it untangled, okay, in the uh, SS Hazelnut, which is 829 SS. So it does also have the shadow shade. Interestingly, this one's smaller. Um, that's kind of weird, but it happens every day and every person that puts, oh. So this one's a little bit smaller. Um, still the Temple to Temple Lays. Yeah, I could see a lot of women really enjoying this style. It's, and this is why I tend to do brunettes more often, or sh the, obviously the shadow shade because I can camouflage my hair. But we've got these long pieces on this side. So there's the right side. left. This one doesn't feel quite as asymmetric. Um, I don't know. You never know. And the back. That's why I always advise if you absolutely, if you possibly can, go try wigs on at a local salon so that you can see how they fit you. And every, every wig is a little bit different. It's like always comparing it to trying on jeans or a pair of shoes. There's just some variability and I, there's probably a plethora of reasons for that. But I highly recommend you try wigs on before you purchase them because it can make a big difference. And nobody's got time to be running back and shipping things back and forth. Um, anyway, really, it, it is a cute style. I like that it's off the nape. I have found, because I get the question often, are wigs hot? And even when I went through menopause, I didn't find wearing a wig on my head was hot. But if the fibers are on my neck, it's hot. The synthetic can get hot. Everybody's different and everybody has a different ex experience. But that's what I found for me. So that's just something to keep in mind as you're looking at wigs and what your temp, how your temperature runs, um, even because it's, it's going to be a lot different on your skin than your, your natural hair would be than human hair. So, um, but as far as the cap, typically, because I've had this question just recently, is a human hair wig going to be less hot than a synthetic? And honestly, not really if it's short because you've still got the cap there and the human hair and the synthetic hair being short like that it's not going to make a lot of difference it's it's really more when it comes down on your body and there too it depends on the actual wig because some human hair wigs have a lot of hair and others don't so it, you've really got to experiment with what's going to work best for you but um that is going to wrap this up for today. This is the go-to style from Raquel Welch for the spring of 2022. Please like, subscribe, and share. That keeps me rolling and keeps me going. And your comments help me know what to present going forward. I love to get those. I read all of them. And if I don't respond, it's because I didn't find it. Because technology is not something that I'm... Well, I'm not bad, but I'm certainly not good at it. So happy to get your comments. I will take requests as I get them. And I really appreciate you joining me. The information about my head size, about the wig, the colors, and all the other things will be down below the, the posting. And I really appreciate it. If you know anybody that has hair loss issues, if you have questions, please feel free to reach out and I will help you as much as I can. Have a great day and enjoy your spring. Look forward to, oh, there's one more wig to be released of the spring collection and I will get those uploaded as soon as I can get my hands on that. So thank you.